In this video, I will show you an overview of SEO Press. We are going to start with the free release and continue to the pro release. Hi, I'm Benjamin Denis, the founder of SEO Press, a freemium WordPress SEO plugin. So, this is a brand new WordPress install and we are going to add SEO Press. Ok, we have SEO Press activated. So, we can go to the settings. This is the SEO Press dashboard, divided in two parts. The first part with the notification center and useful links. And the second part with all the features. To quickly enable or disable a feature, just click the green iOS toggle and click Manage to access all the options of the feature. In Titles and Meta, you can globally configure the meta titles, descriptions and robots for each of your templates, namely Home, Single Post Types, Archives and Taxonomies. With a few clicks, you can edit the title of a specific post type, tell Google to not index or follow links of a specific template, in this example post, display the date in Google search results, and much more. Let's continue with XML and HTML sitemap page. With SEO Press, you can generate a sitemap index containing a sitemap of your content sorted by post types, a sitemap for images, and an HTML sitemap. The post types and taxonomies tabs allow you to include the different content that you want to add when generating the XML sitemap. Finally, the HTML sitemap tab allows you to create a sitemap for your visitors. Several options are available, such as the exclusion of an article with its ID, the order of post, sorting, etc. Note that individual defined content on no index will not be visible in your XML and HTML sitemap. Once your sitemap is set up, make sure to flush your permalinks, then click View your sitemap. In the social network settings, you can set up the Google Knowledge Graph using the first two tabs, Knowledge Graph and your social accounts. The last two allow to configure your Open Graph Meta and Twitter cards to optimize the display of your shared links on social networks like Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter or Pinterest. Natively, SEO Press offers integration with Google Analytics. Just pass your tracking ID in SEO Press and you can add statistics to your site. Many options are available, such as LGPD compatibility, user role exclusion from tracking, IP anonymization, link attribution, cross domain tracking, remarketing event trackings, external event, downloads, affiliate, and custom dimensions. If you use a caching plugin on your site, do not forget to cure your cache after configuring the tracking. In the advanced setting page, you will find advanced SEO options like redirect attachment page to post parent. Do not uncheck this option unless you know what you're doing. Add a tiny MCE editor to term description. Remove stop words, remove slash category, etc. etc. All of these options are advanced settings. You have to know what you are doing by checking or unchecking one of these options. You can also configure the SEO Press appearance in the WordPress admin. You can remove the SEO Press logo in admin bar, add or remove columns in your post type list, etc. And we also have a security tab to block SEO Metabox or Content Analysis Metabox. 
to user roles. And the last option page is tools. From this page, you can import or export your SEO press settings from a site to another site, import post and terms metadata from Yoast, all-in-one SEO and the SEO framework. You can reset all the notification from the notification centers and reset all your settings. Thank you for watching the first part of the quick overview of SEO Press. In part two, you will learn more about the pro release of our plugin. To receive the latest videos about SEO and SEO Press, do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.